This is probably the hardest video that I've ever had to make, ever. And I know I've only been on YouTube for three and a half years now, but uh, let's clear the elephant in the room first. How was Australia? Australia was life changing. An opportunity to meet so many wonderful people and creators, fans, just things that I never thought that I would get to do in, in ever. I mean, I, I come from a small background. I started YouTube as a way for me to get over social anxiety and to be able to take it and meet people that I'm fans of, people who are fans of me and the girls was, it, it puts things into a different perspective when you get like a, a punch in the face, how effective the things that you do are to people, which led to the mask coming off. As many of you know, um, and through my previous video, I deal with really bad social anxiety. I've had it referred to as also avoidant personality disorder. I try to avoid things that make me incredibly uncomfortable with being in front of a camera right now. My heart is like <laughs> But I learned in Australia that I have been holding myself back, not just by the mask, but using my anxiety as an excuse not to experience the things that I want to experience. I started off in Australia wearing my mask everywhere. At PAX, I wore it completely all the time, even out with friends and stuff. But it's really hard to be with a group of friends and be the only one that's like not fully there. I hope that makes sense. I'm probably rambling, but the point is, is here I am. I'm so scared to do this, but I am so ready. Um, one of the important lessons besides coming out of my comfort zone that I learned in Australia is, well, let me quote, uh, and a book that I'm listening to. Jimmy Carr's Before and Laughter. He has a chapter in the book called Facing the Fear and Shitting Your Pants. And that's basically what it is. That's, that's life, at least what I've learned. When Glitch and I were traveling for Australia is when Dream's Face Reveal came out. And I don't know if you guys know the hubbub that Bruh. happened with that, but if he got it that bad, I'm nobody. So after seeing the reaction that Dream's Face Reveal got and seeing how much strength it took for him to do that, it kind of like sparked it in me. And then going to Australia, meeting all, meeting the girls in person, like what? Seeing all of these beautiful women in front of me who, well, I mean, they babes, but also coming out of their comfort zone and then going to PAX, meeting the fans, it's just, it's time. And I'm probably going to regret it. And it's going to be one of those things where I wake up tomorrow and I'm like, what the f did you do? But it's time. Um, what does it mean for the channel? Not a whole lot. Other than I'm not going to have a big black square across my face. Streams are going to be still the same on camera. Speaking of streams, they're going to be on Jiry now. So for those of you who are subscribed to Jiry Live, thank you so much. You have no idea how much of a foundation that set for me. Because even just streaming was hard for me. And being live, not being able to edit it, watching what I have to say. It was a massive, massive learning experience. But... I kind of want to keep everything together now, especially with the way that YouTube is going with, you know, the separate sections for videos and shorts and this, that, and the other thing. I want to keep everything on Jiry. I'm known as Jiry and splitting everybody into different sections is probably not a good thing. So this Sunday, Jiry will have a stream. Um, it's probably going to be just a simple stream, maybe Among Us with fans. So make sure you keep an eye out for that. For videos, I have two or three videos that uh, still have my mask on. We're going to finish up Ultimate Custom Night VR. I have a second video coming out with that with my mask on. Hello Puppets just came out. Hello Puppets 2. So we're going to go back and see Scout and Mortimer and pick up where the VR version left off. If you haven't seen it, make sure you check it out on my channel. The girls just posted part one of the vlog. Um, showing you more detail what we did in PAX, the panel, kind of, sort of, my clap back at Molly, and some of the stuff that we got up to. Make sure you subscribe because we recorded some pretty crazy stuff while we were in Australia. Other than that, same as usual, we're going to be doing VR games, um, especially with the Quest Pro coming out. I'm going to be covering more Quest content, obviously more VR stuff, more PC stuff. I want to focus the PC stuff on horror. So if you guys have any recommendations for horror games, make sure to drop them down in the comments below. Uh, this is getting really rambly. I just wanted to check in and say hi. Uh, the past two weeks have been really crazy. The lead up to Australia, actually going to Australia, is taking a lot out of me. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm still kind of getting over something. Not sure what, Pax Box. So yeah. 
it's nice to meet you finally officially without hiding and being weird um make sure to keep an eye on the channel subscribe to the girls subscribe to glitch daddy because he may have a little something coming out on his own um other than that yeah bye